Hello everybody, welcome to Being Civil. In this video, I will draw the shear force and bending moment diagram of a cantilever beam with UDL, W per unit length and a point load P at the free end. The length of the beam is L. So to draw the shear force and bending moment diagram, first we have to take the section X at a distance small x from the free end. So we will first calculate the shear force of the section we cut. So we have cut the section at this end, we will take the right side portion of this section. So this is P and this length is X. So the total load of this section is W into X plus P. So the shear force at distance X is WX plus P. And the nature of the force is left up, right down. So this is positive. So this is positive. Now SF at x equal to 0 that is the free end is W into 0 plus P so equals to P and at the fixed end where x equal to L will be W into L plus P. So the shear force diagram will start here at P and will linearly vary and go to WL plus P at the fixed end. So this is the shear force diagram and it is positive. Now we will draw the bending moment. So again we will take the section right side of X and the bending moment at this section will be the P into this distance X. So P into X plus the UDL is W, the total load W into X. And the CG distance from here is X by 2. So X by 2. So, and the nature of the force is like this. So hogging. So it is a negative. So the bending moment is negative. So when BMX will be minus PX plus WX squared by 2. Now at X equal to 0 minus P into 0 plus 0. So 0. And at free at fixed end, so X equal to L, it will be minus PL and w l squared by 2 and you see the equation is varies with x squared so it will start here at 0 and it will be parabolic curve like this here 0 and here minus p l plus w l squared by 2 it's a negative sign I hope you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share with your friends, see you in the next video.